Hi again then guys, and so when we left off, technically speaking, we'd just burned the big ones in this room. They put up fire, we've got these guys in here now. But it's actually a lot more than that that's happened, to be completely honest. And just to fill you guys in, basically I recorded episode, or this episode, and the next episode already. But I then found out afterwards that all of that data was corrupted. Episode, the entirety of episode 24 and 25 was completely corrupted and unusable. And the problem was, I had then saved at that point. So I couldn't go back and do this. So, long story short, I've had to play through the entire game again to get back to this point. Which was annoying. It didn't take as long, because I'm not doing commentary and also because I know what I'm doing more. So it's actually taken roughly half the time to get to this point again. And we've got all three guys with us, they've all got plenty of ammo, and basically we're going to continue on. So when we left off of course, we had gained control of those switches, we burned the monsters, we got those in, we've reached our save point. Just to check our stock, we've got plenty of health, okay, plenty of grenades, and plenty of weaponry. To be honest, the stun gun is kind of useless in this game, to be completely honest. I don't really like throwing anything away, but still. So they are all following. Um, okay. So basically I, I gave this chappy the shotgun, which I wouldn't have usually done, but to be honest, at this point in the game, it's more the soldiers. Let's get these guys back here. Um, it's more the soldiers and sp okay. it's more the soldiers and spiders at this point. Okay. So that's that thing dealt with. Got some more ammo. Oh, yes, yes, sir. sir. We are screwed. Okay, so let's get him. Okay. To fix that. So yeah, it was it was pretty annoying to be completely honest to have to play through the whole game again. To be honest, the idea of having to play through the idea of having to play through was uh, more annoying really than actually playing through. Because the only part of the game, to be honest, that I actually find difficult or found difficult back in the previous episodes was the part on the submarine. Because when you're running through those hallways and you've got to kill those two big ones that end up wandering around, it's just annoying. It takes so long to get past that point. It seems that no matter what I do previously to that in the game, I always end up with hardly any health at that point. As though there's not really anything you can do about that. Okay, so it sounds like we've got a big guy and for some reason... The other guy has now gone. So, you see, stuff like that, it, it, I love this game. It's definitely in my top ten, but stuff like that does annoy me, to be honest, because what's the point in trying to keep them alive when the game just then deletes people for no reason? And that's not a glitch, because it did that last time as well with the same guy. Which is kind of annoying, to be fair. So let's change up. Let's get some health. Okay. Okay. Why would you walk in the way of someone shooting? 
Bitte. So, are we all clear of spiders? It would appear so. Where's he going? <laughs> yes, sir. So I keep on saying at different points throughout the game that it feels like the game's ending soon, but <laughs> to be fair, this game is a lot bigger than I expected it to be. So, we've got this control, which is probably the door, I think. Hmm. Interesting. So we've got furnace controls, and it would appear probably a furnace control over here as well. So, let's open the door. We got company. Oh dear, let's close that for a second. So, that was a shame after all that. Um, let's change back to the machine gun. Aha, uh -huh. so it looks like we've got some guards. I'm going to tell him to stay here. Okay. Uh-oh. <laughs> I think we'll wait here then, because it doesn't look like there are any guys up here. Some ammo. Hmm, looks like we're okay for the moment. Can't see any more guys. So I think, before we get him to move, because I don't really want him to die, so before we get... Uh -huh. Aha! So we've got another matey boy over there. Some more ammo. Um... You must be infected. <laughs> uh, I think I'll go down here and check it out. Aha! Uh -huh. Fair amount of life still in those little things. <laughs> it's 
kind of clever how they hide in the how they hide in the bodies. So I can hear a save point in there. And I can't see any more soldiers. Okay, so the question is, I think we'll go for the save point first. Come on, move. Stuck on railings. Follow moi. Okay. And get him to open this. Plenty of ammo. Give the game a save. So basically I found out that this time what I need to do is what you can see here, which is having different save points instead of just keep rewriting the top one. Which is kind of annoying, but... or well not annoying that I have to do that, but annoying that I didn't do that in the first place, because if I had, losing a couple of episodes wouldn't have been an issue. So, where should we go next? I think we'll get the other guy before we move anywhere else. Check out. Oh, lovely. Looks like we've got a creature in here. I need an engineer. All right. Let's see what's inside this room. Oh, cutscene. Dun, dun, dun. Uh oh. You're in bad shape, soldier. What happened? Whitley. He tried to gun me down. But he didn't quite finish the job. Okay. Mm I wonder where that soldier came from then. Get me a weapon. Let's get Dixon outside. We'll wait here. Okay. Out. <laughs> um, and what do we have to give him? Got a flamethrower, machine gun. Okay. Yes, sir. Oh, what's this? Oh, another sniper rifle. And whatever that was, I'm not sure. Some kind of explosive, perhaps. Why is he crouching? We got company. Have we? You sure about that? <laughs> oh, apparently we have. He did. Loop, loop, loop. Okay, let's get over here now then.
Hmm. Oh well then, he's dead. I'm not sure exactly how that happened. Another blood test kit, that's kind of obsolete now to be fair. Got some more ammo. Uh, in that case, let's give him some more ammo. Yes, sir. Okay, now he's got more ammo than me. <laughs> How much ammo's he got? Yeah, he's got plenty. Uh, anything else of note? Wouldn't appear so. I think we will use a blood test kit on him. All right, let's do this. Okay, so he's okay. Good, good. And now let's go. What can he see? Pick up a bit more ammo. I think we'll give it a quick save again, actually. And it would appear that pretty much the last thing to do in this room now is to go through that door on the end. I think we also have furnace controls. So let's open that. We got company. They did. <laughs> so so far the, the furnace controls don't seem to do that much. So we've got controls for guessing that's furnace controls. Oh no, it's not. So what is that? Hmm. Not sure exactly what that's controlling, to be honest. And through this door, it would appear we have... What door number is this? I guess this is door number one, so let's open door number two. And I reckon we're going to have some creatures through here. So, we're going to do that in the next episode. So I'll see you guys next time, and as always, thanks for watching.